and hello! I think my head's cut off. Welcome! It's Saturday night, it's 8 o'clock, which can mean only one thing. It can mean you're having a dinner, or you're joining in in Bobby Seagull's Quiz for NHS Family Special. So thank you so much for joining me on a Saturday night. You know, you could be out there. To be honest, it's not barbecue weather. It's been torrential rain here in East London. What's the weather been like for you? Well, thank you so much for joining. I think it's time for round number two. Spin that globe, spin that globe. It's time for geography. Are you ready? Are you ready? So geography and pictures. Question, round number two. Round number two, here we go. Here we go. Okay, so these are gonna be pictures uh, with geography. Are you ready, crazy peacocks? Are you ready? Okay, here we go. Question number one. Identify the country. Identify the country. Question number one. Identify this particular country. Okay, question number two. Question number two. Identify this city. Identify this city. That's question number two. Question two is identify this city. I gave it to my brother. He took a he took a bit of a he was like, well, what's this? Tommy's like, oh I know, I think I know this. Identify this city. That's question number two. Question number three. Identify this museum. Identify this museum. That's question number three. Identify this museum. Okay, question four. This is going to test you. This is going to test you. Identify the country by this outline of a map. So identify the country by the outline of a map. That's question number four. Question number four. That's got you thinking, hasn't it? That's got you thinking. Question number four. And then question number five. Which city is this bridge in? Which city is this bridge in? That's question number five. I'm smirking because Emily Butt on YouTube made the comment said, are you the Bobby Siegel of Celebrity Mastermind fame? fame? Yes. Thing is, in the first few weeks, or well, if you're on um, YouTube, don't type in the comments in the box. Don't type, I'll just have to block you. I know it's accidental. Don't type it in there. Um, in the first few weeks of doing the quiz, I'd always bring this out. This, wait, wait. Bring out this baby. This is my, um, so if you, look, ah, it's my, it's my precious, it's my precious. This is my, this is my Celebrity Mastermind trophy. Actually, now, I don't bring it out voluntary and now if the people demand it I'll bring it this is actually a good teaching tool it's a um, triangular based prism so you can teach um, areas and volumes of objects but it's also a handy doorstep a handy doorstep there we go okay there we go okay so let's let's re let's recap the um, question so question five which city is this bridge in question four identify the country question three identify the museum question two identify city and question one identify the country it's time for your you know it you know it your 10 second dance 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 that's your time that's your time that's your time so here we go so question one was uh, kenya kenya one mark Question number two. This is Moscow. It's Moscow. That's Moscow. Question number two. Question three. This is the Natural History Museum. Natural History Museum. 
So, you know, you used to have um, Dippy the dinosaur, but this is Hope the blue whale. So this is um, the Natural History Museum. Question four. Question four. Someone accidentally typed it on YouTube. It's okay, but try not to. It's Egypt. Egypt. And again, if you look at the map of Africa, there we go. And again, if you like Egypt, one of my classes on YouTube uh, about a few weeks ago was on ancient Egypt. Um, and here is an amazing Egypt fact, which I shared with some of my maths classes. So, we know Cleopatra, yeah? And we know the Great Pyramids of uh, Giza, you know, the, the famous ones. And we know McDonald's. And this is astonishing. So you've got uh, the Great Pyramids of G Giza. Uh, no, which way around is it? Then Cleopatra, then McDonald's. Cleopatra lived closer to the time of McDonald's opening than she did to the Great Pyramids of Giza by about 50 years. That's astonishing. Cleopatra lived closer to the opening of McDonald's than she did for the opening of the Pyramids of Giza. And it shows you how long the Egyptian empire was. Mad. Madness. And the final one was, um, the web says someone went there. This is actually, if I'd gone extended a bit further to the left, you'd have seen the Sydney Opera House. Sydney, there you go. There you go. How have we done after two rounds? Let me know your scores. Two rounds in. Two rounds in. Two rounds in. Let me know your scores. How are we doing? These quizzes are uh, in aid for the NHS. So if you feel at any stage for any of the quizzes, justgiving.com forward slash quiz for NHS.